I'm Jessica, and today we are going to learn how to draw bubble letters with shadows. So let's start with a nice, easy word. We're going to start with the word dog. We're going to do a nice round top and a bubble for the bottom and a bubble for the bottom part of the line at the top. Of course, don't forget to put your circle in, which is the space in the D. Nice O. Your O is going to want to be about the same size as the D. Same size circle in the middle, and a nice round G body, which is also going to be about the same size as the D and the O. Piece at the top that comes wrapped around, almost like a dog tail. There we go. Now we want to do a little bit of shadowing on these letters. So we can do this in a couple different ways. We can do 3D shadowing to show that these words are 3D put a little bit of shadow in there. Just a little bit of coloring along the edges to show that there's a light source coming from this direction. You want to make sure to leave space between the letters so that when you bring it out to make it 3D or to make it have shadow, that there's space and they don't all cram together. Nobody likes to be crammed together. Letters don't like it either. So there we go. A little bit of space there. The light is coming from this direction, so it would be on the bottom going up into the top and maybe a little bit there. Now as you can see, there's none on this side and there's none on this side because the light is coming from this direction. We're also going to do a little on the edge there. There we go. Now if you wanted to do shadow on the actual letter, you might do some diagonal lines coming down the side of the letter to show that there's actually a little bit of shadow on the letters. Just bring the lines at an angle down, all in the same direction on each letter, just to show that there's a little bit of shadow there. This also makes a nice, thick element to the letter, gives it a little bit of more solid looking -ness. And there you have it, bubble letters with shadow.